Hi everyone. Hopefully everyone can hear me. Hello. I hope everyone had a good week. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I know it's a little loud to my right because the dishwasher machine is going off, but anyways. Hello Alejandro. Hello. Good day, yes, good day to you too. Hi Tom, hi Mark, hi Steph. Hello. <laughs> okay, so today we are gonna be making Funfetti, um, Funfetti mug cakes. And I'm so excited to show you guys because this is my first baking live and I'm I found a really easy recipe online, so hopefully everyone can follow along. Um, but before I add my friends in, Gordon and Steph, I'm going to be going over the materials and the ingredients that are needed for this baking activity. So the first thing that we're going to need is all-purpose flour. So maybe while I go over the ingredients list, everybody could grab what they need to follow along if they want to if you want to um, and then you're also going to need sugar this is my sugar and you're going to need baking powder and I tested my uh, mug cake in the weekend so that's why it looks used so it's in here yes hello from Chicago hi Alyssa afterwards you're going to need salt so my salt is here. And then you're going to need uh, butter. Butter is in my fridge. I'm going to keep it in my fridge. Actually, I'll, I'll bring it out. Um, Okay, butter. I'll bring it out because we need to melt it anyways. So this is my butter. And milk. Milk is in my fridge. And vanilla extract as well as sprinkles. And I got this fun one from Walmart with all these different fun sprinkles. But I think I'm gonna use this one for the original Funfetti cake. Yes, like a very tiny amount of salt, just a dash of salt, not too much. Um, and then what else? Oh yeah, and for ingredients, oh, well, I mean for the materials, you're gonna need a mug and we're gonna put our dry ingredients in our mug first and then I also have a bowl for our wet ingredients so we can stir them separately first. And then we would need a one fourth cup. So I have this one here, as well as your measuring spoons. And this is mine. Um, and then a knife to scrape off the flour and a spoon and to mix everything together. And also, um, you're gonna need a microwave for it. So you don't need an oven, so it's super easy. All right, now that I went over everything, I'm going to invite my friends in. Hopefully he'll come in. Yes, it's a vanilla flavored cake. Hi Steph, how are you? Hi everyone. Hi. I can't see your face. Now I can see you. How are you? I got my mug. I love your mug. Your mug is so pretty. Mine is just red, but yours is super pretty. It's like a mason jar. Are you excited for the baking today? It's got a handle, so. Yeah, it looks really nice. I like it. Are you ready to bake? I'm so excited. I got my all purpose flour right here. Yes, very nice. I Did you want to get started? I got my sugar, I got my milk. Awesome. What I'm so I glad need? you had. Um, so you need flour, you need sugar. Do you have your sugar? Yes, nice. And then you're gonna need baking powder. Do you have your baking powder with you? Yes, we'll just go over the ingredients again. That's totally fine. Oh, someone asked if that's a glass or a porcelain mug. Um, I think it's a porcelain mug. I had to get mug. my baking powder the 
And the cat. No, you're okay. You're good. I go nice. my magic powder. Like, I like it. Um, magic, and... magic baking powder. So. Awesome. Then you're gonna need. Oh, someone's phone is going. <laughs> oh no, someone's phone is going off. Okay, right. that's okay. I think she's on a phone call right now. Hi, Kelly. How are you, Kelly? Hope you're doing right. well. Are you going to be following along with the recipe today, Kelly? I want, I want me to cook for you. Are. Soccer? Mm, yeah. So we're just making a vanilla funfetti cake. I feel like that's a bit easier. Sorry, my but... mom had to call because she wanted me to record soccer. Oh, no, you're good. You're good. Um, yeah. Because Candy's oh, playing right now, but I just, I'm like, I'm not that big into soccer right now, so I'm not really <laughs> a fan. That's okay. Um, then, where was I? Baking powder, and then do you have your salt? Just the, we just need a dash of salt. It's not, not too much. Just a little bit. Salt. I have a little bit of Himalayan salt, but, but it may not be regular salt, but it's Himalayan salt. But. Or you, you, you probably just don't really need to use it to either, like, if you don't want to. It's just, like, a little bit. It's a dash, but, yeah, it's really up to you. I'm sure it will be okay. I just have to figure out how to open it. Is it the one where you twist it? Like this? I'm gonna, um, I'm like, open some one way. I don't know how it opens. That's okay. If you can't figure it out, you don't have to use it. That's okay. Um, and then you have your butter, right? And you have I'm your milk. Right in front of me. And your milk and your vanilla extract, right? Lovely. You have your vanilla extract, too. Oh, I'm going to find that word. Is there? I'm just bringing a chair here so I could sit down a bit. Vanilla extract and then sprinkles. And that's about it. Or I have pure vanilla extract if that helps. Lovely. That's good. Um, and then do you have your sprinkles as well? That's also an option. You don't have to use it. It's a fun cake, so. Vanilla Siva is better because vanilla extract has alcohol in it. Ooh, I did not know that. But yes, that's a good alternative. Thank you, Kelly. That's a very good alternative. I got my sprinkles. They're not, like, they're not the biggest kind, but they're just a little kind. That's okay. That works. Yay. Awesome. Okay. Should we get started now? Let's get started. So first, let's grab our flour. Let's open it. I'm going to open my flour. Will it be enough to go in this mug, though? Yep, it will be enough. Um, oh, gosh. I'm getting it all over the place. Um, and then you're going... How much of the flour do I need? So you're going to get your one-fourth cup one fourth cup um yeah this measuring cup and you're gonna put one you're gonna put one fourth in this one this one says one fourth right like a uh, cup cup so you it might be, it might look like this for you. Oh, let me see. Like this one. One fourth cup. You could use this one too, but I had a actual, had a different measuring cup. This one. Something like this. I have one tablespoon, but I don't know if that's big enough. Do you have something like this, like a one fourth cup? You could say cup on it. I 
I have a small glass one. Does it say one fourth on it? One fourth cup? It's like right down at the bottom. Yep. So you're just going to fill your flour up to one fourth cup and then you you can put it in your your mug. But it, make sure it says one fourth, right? One fourth. I'm just going to put the dry ingredients in my mug. Oh my god, my boyfriend is such a sweetheart. Mm hmm God, he's so patient. Oh, that's sweet. Like, is there it's anything like, that happens? Anything I do is I'm like, he's like, honey, like, don't worry about that. Like, <laughs> we'll figure it out. Like, I'm like the one that's like the worst at procrastinating. It's so, like, I don't know. I don't know if I can do both at the same time. I'm just like, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like when you get to that point, I'm like, do I have this one do this or am I going to do this later? Oh, I see. Well, yours says one fourth, right? One out of four? One out of four, right? One out of four cups. It's not been done yet. Okay. I'm just trying Let to scoop it out. Let me know once you have this done. I'm just trying to scoop it out of the bag, though. It's, it's hard to figure out. I'm not trying to get too much flour, so I'm just trying to figure this out. Let me see. One fourth. One fourth. Um. Let me see from my cup. I think this is pretty close to one fourth, though. I do believe. One fourth. It says one fourth for yours, on your side. Okay. Yeah. Hopefully it says one fourth. Is that is that a crack though? Could you turn it around on the other side? Uh, yes, one fourth, good. Awesome. That's all that I need. Um, so pour that in first, and then we're gonna need one and a half teaspoon. But we'll figure that out together after you put your one fourth in. Nice. Yay. Okay. I just got it over my got something on my sweater just now. Yeah, same here. All right. Tell me when we can move on. I'm trying to scoop up some of the mess I made, so just <laughs> put it back in the jar. Oh, and yeah, clean up as I go. Of... Yes. That's a good that's a good strategy. I just put the spoon in the dishwasher. Nice. Some people say they are celebrating Thanksgiving. And I can put in my dishwasher. All right. Now, shall we move on? Yeah, next one. Okay, so then we're going to get one teaspoon. So get your measuring um, spoons. And then one teaspoon. So it should say one TSP. I got this one. Yep. Does it say one TSP? SP. Something that's one tablespoon, I guess. I think that's one tablespoon. Could you try finding one that says one teaspoon? So it says it has a P on it. And this one says one, one TSP, though. Oh, good, good, good. Yes, that's the one we're looking for. And then we're going to put flour on it again. So one teaspoon of flour. Like that? Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put it into our mug. Awesome. And then grab your half teaspoon. So 
it should be one over two TSP. Let me show you an example. This one. So one, oh, you should say one over two TSP. Uh, it, yeah, it's really hard to see. TSP. Is that one? Yes, yes, that one. And then flower again, flower for that one again. It's a lot of flower. Okay, awesome. Now let's pour it in. Like that? Yep. Nice. Okay, now we're going to get our tablespoon. So do you remember the one with the T T B, the T B S P, the T B one? So one tablespoon. The one that you grabbed. Um, the one, one with the B, the B, the B, T S B, one tablespoon. That one. Yes, one. T yes, and then you're going to add sugar onto it. Let me just roll up my flour first. Sorry, mine needs a big, huge jar of sugar. Sent. <laughs> That's okay. So we're gonna pour that in. Mine's in this jar. This is how my sugar jar looks like. And then pour that in. Hi, Kelly. I know you guys are celebrating Thanksgiving in, I think, the United States right now, which is so cool. I think this is one tablespoon of sugar. Mm -hmm. And then you can pour it in your mug. And then we're going to do it one more time. One more time. With the same measuring spoon. So that means two tablespoons in total. Yeah, I know my boyfriend's the one. The one? That's really cute. <laughs> I know in my heart I want to marry him. Mm hmm How long have you guys been together? Almost 13 years. 13 years? Yeah, almost 13 years come this... Whoa, that's so long. Like, he's just like that one person that can just like calm my waters. I'm like, hey, mm -hmm. don't worry about it. It's, it's not worth that. Oh, that's I'm, sweet. I just don't like to argue with the others. I'm like, don't argue with whatever they're doing. It's like, just let them do what they're doing. It's fine. <laughs> I was like, but they're trying to bug me. They're doing the same sort of thing to bug me. It's like, can you just, just leave it? <laughs> There's no need to argue with the rest of them. They'll just, they just won't, they just won't get caught up. It's like, we're just busy. We're just doing our thing right now. We're busy. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you guys are doing so well in your to, relationship. You just have to come to a compromise, right? It's like, you guys, I'm like, oh, why don't you go spend time with the, like, go spend time with the girls for the night or whatever. They go, go find the <laughs> friends for a little bit. Like, don't worry about this. Oh, you say so, weird. like, I'll go out, like, doesn't matter. He wants you to have fun. Yeah, like, go out, like, go and have fun, like, don't worry about that. <laughs> so I'm, All right. Okay. <laughs> You're right, I, I just misunderstood. All right, so now, let's get our one-fourth teaspoon. So one out of four, one out of four TSP. One out of four TSP. Is it a little difficult to see? So this one. One you, out of four. Do I need my measuring cup again? Um, it's the one with the teaspoon. Teaspoon. So the first time we used a cup, so now we're gonna be using a teaspoon. 
Do you have one out of four TSP? I think that's the one we're looking for. Yeah, sorry, this is the way that it's being shown. It's a little harder because it's reflective. Hopefully everyone can see that. One out of four TSB, one fourth teaspoon. I mean, like that one there? Um, is it TSP? It's TSP, right? Sorry, yeah. it's upside down. Yeah, that one. And then you're going to put your baking powder for this one. So mine comes in a little packet like this. But yes, I saw the one. Yeah, you had your jar, which is good. That means that means you make a lot of desserts at home, right? Um, I want to start making Chris's desserts. Like I would like to make some Nanaimo bars. Ooh. That's fun. What are you planning on making for your Christmas for kinda, Christmas meal? I don't know because I have I have oh no, I'm waiting on my oldest sister to see if she's gonna come home because I know the other one won't be able to make it, so Oh no. Is it just like it's the airlines are ridiculous. Like they're they're not being fair. The airlines? Yeah, like they won't let someone that has a disability fly fly with their dog, and I think that's ridiculous. Like, oh man. And well, hopefully you'll so be able upset to... because it's like, why can't people with disabilities be able to have their support dog, or they have to get someone to come out there with them? Yeah. That has a pass. It's like you can. Because I think it's ridiculous. Like people with disabilities had to either they had to fly with a worker or they had to fly with family, and I'm like, that's ridiculous. Like I shouldn't have to like I shouldn't have to be doing this thing where it's like I should be able to fly with whoever I want. Like mm -hmm. I shouldn't have to wait for somebody to come with me. Well, hopefully it all works out at the end. You can let me know what happens so you could visit your. Sister. I got my I put my baking powder in. Yep, you're gonna put it in your mug. How many scoops do I need? Just one? Just one, yeah. All right. And then after, we're just going to get our salt. And if you don't have salt, that's totally fine. Just put, like, a really tiny bit. Like, I'm just going to put the smallest amount. Like, the smallest. It's kind of hard to show it, but, I don't know yeah. how the salt thing works, so. Sure. Yeah, that's okay. You don't have to use it. I... It will make it too salty, too, if we add in too much salt. But anyways. I'm just going to put this stuff away as I'm going. Sure, no problem. Bring it away. We can do a little cleanup <laughs> moment now. I'm just going to put away my sugar and salt. It's ironic because me and my boyfriend had to go. We're going to my we're going to my my oldest sister's wedding next year together. So it's like it's kind of ironic. It's like it's kind of ironic that we're going to going back to the start of where we started. It's oh, like really? we're just like it's like I think it's like it's so romantic. It's like when you think back, you're just like, oh my god, we're going back to the very beginning of how we started. Like we started like. He was so cheesy that night. It was so funny. I cannot stop laughing. Like, he was so cheesy. <laughs> He's like, what's the cheesy song that he used on me? It's like, oh, something in the matter of like, can I get your phone number or something like that? And it was like, mm -hmm. was like oh my God, you're so cheesy. <laughs> so cheesy. <laughs> like, I was like, are you joking? Or are you for real? And I'm like, no, for real. Like, I want your phone number. I was I'm like, okay, yeah, like. <laughs> <laughs> like being like my like not so obvious all well. So I'm like, oh, fine, come on, like he's so like in my mind. I'm like, okay, he's so handsome, like just do it. Just just who cares? Who cares? Just <laughs> we're do just, it. Like, and like we're up to like that day and I was like, I'm like I was over to like the next day and I was like, I cannot stop thinking about him. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, no, don't call him right away. Like, don't text him right away. Just like wait a few days, like wait until he says something else. I'm like, no, but like what if I don't like what do we like? What if I don't start the conversation? And it gets awkward, and then we don't, then we don't like, like 
complete sentence or whatever. Oh. <laughs> well, nice. I try though. I I think I won the bouquet once before at my cousin's wedding. Oh, you 13 did? years ago that I won the bouquet of flowers, and I was I'm like, see, it's meant see, to be. This is how that works. <laughs> it's meant to be. <laughs> no, okay. No, it's like even now our feelings are still confirmed with each other. We still are. Even through COVID, we still manage, you know. I'm like, it still, like, it still works. <laughs> it still, still works. <laughs> like, we'll go and do dates with our friends, and we'll still, like, we'll still, like, fix them up. It's like, you had to help me. <laughs> Honey, if any of my friends, in the, if any of my best buddies' friends are dating, you had to help me. <laughs> I will not let this slide. You will not let it slide. All right, now, let's get our butter. My butter is in here. I might need a knife for this. Okay. And. I might need a knife though. Always be careful with knives though. Yes. And you're going to need your one tablespoon. So one TSB. TSB. That one? Uh, yes. TSB, right? That's a B for yours. One's one. It's a one TBS. TBS. Yeah, 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 sounds good. And then you're going to put butter. One tablespoon of butter. And then I'm just going to use my knife to scrape it off a bit. So it's I'm nice and too. even. Yay, twins. And then instead of putting it in your mug, Steph, why don't you get another bowl? Because we have to melt it in the microwave well, this one's already melted it's it's pretty melted it's melted for you okay so then you can put it in your mug i guess yeah this is pretty melty already so okay and then i'm I'm just gonna put mine in because we, we keep our butter out on the on the island so it's, it gets pretty melty by the stove so oh that makes sense yeah i put mine in the fridge so that's why <laughs> yeah okay you got that I'm just putting the rest into my jar. No problem. Well, this is nice. It's like an extra, like, extra late birthday cake. It is. How was your birthday? I know it was like a few days ago, but. Oh, really? Did you have fun? I got A&W for my birthday, so I was pretty happy with that. That's good. Hi, Shanika. We're baking. I cannot wait then 33. Like when I went over to my aunt and uncle's house on the weekend, they're just like, I know, yeah, no, I went to my cousin's house on the weekend. They're just like, and then my aunt and uncle were there. It's like, I cannot believe that you're 33 already. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you grow up. With your so next fast. steps or whatever, I'm like, huh? <laughs> like, you're just like, next steps. What, what are we talking about now? <laughs> it's like, are you going to get a house? Are you going to get, like, are you and your boyfriend going to move in together? And I was like, I'm like, so much Why is pressure. It all hammering already. Like, what's the with this already? <laughs> so like, much. You're pressure. like hammering with these questions already. It's like, are you, mm -hmm. are you new boyfriend and moving together? Are you guys gonna like get married or whatever? It's like, what's this hammering? <laughs> hammering on questions already. Jeez. <laughs> I just think about eating eating some chips. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, after the butter, we're gonna put one more. Wait, don't put the butter away yet. We need one more scoop of oh, of butter. Know. Yes. I'm just trying to clean up as I go, so. Oh, okay, so we're going to get the same t uh, spoon that we had, the one TSB, and then we're going to get our butter one more time and put that in. That's so a lot of butter, taste. though, for... It is a lot of butter, but I guess that's why it tastes, tastes good and sweet. <laughs> I'm just so, nice yeah. that, like, when you do these little things and your boyfriend's like, oh, when do you, like... Go and do something fun, just a, just a TV or whatever. Do like a nice little craft or something so you don't get bored or whatever. <laughs> That's sweet. Like, cause, cause my boyfriend works. My boyfriend works doing the snow removal and all that right now, so I just had to find a way to be creative. Oh, so, I see. It's like, what I do is do like some baking or something to keep to keep myself from being too like too bored or whatever. Mm-hmm. Just, I'm going I was, to. I, I was just watching Manifest because I got my Netflix back. So I was, I was just. Oh, you got your Manifest. Netflix. Well, that's fun. I'm going to melt my butter now in the microwave for around 15 seconds, just so that it's like liquefied a bit. 
But I might put mine in the microwave too. I might put my cup in the. Do we need just the butter put... or should I put the butter away? Uh, we don't need the butter anymore. But when you put it in the microwave, you can just put it in for like, like ten or fifteen seconds. It doesn't have to be for too long, just to get it melted a bit. I'm just cleaning up my mess as I go. Sounds good. So mine is in the microwave for. I'm only doing 15 seconds. And then I'm going to put my butter yeah, away. I, I just clean up while I go. That way that I can put it in the dishwasher and then I can move on the dishwasher. Okay, mine is melted now. Well, mine is really melted. I'm just going to let it cool off a bit. And then... I'm just going to put mine I'm gonna put mine in the microwave for 15 minutes. Oh, 15 seconds. Ten, or 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Not too long. Hi, Gordon. How are you, Gordon? Oh, Gordon, I went to a Maple Leafs game. Like, live. Yeah, I wanted to tell you about it. Okay, cool. It's melted? Mm. It's not quite liquefied, but... It's okay. We'll, it, it will get more liquefied when we microwave it again later. So, it's okay. I'll just put it back in for 10 more seconds. 10 more seconds? Okay. Not just, not too long, okay? And then... Okay, now it's liquefied. Okay, that's good. All right, now, now let's get our milk. I'm gonna get my milk in the fridge. I got my milk. Nice. And then we're going to use the TSB. So for you, it should be TBS, the tablespoon, yeah? And we're gonna put three tablespoons of milk inside. Oh, this one wasn't even opened yet. So. <laughs> nice and new. How was the hockey oh, game? It was so fun. The hockey game was so fun. I was sitting behind, um, like, I was sitting up high, but it was, like, behind the I one of the goalies. I accidentally put my spoon in the dishwasher, so now I just had to figure out how to. Yes, yeah, so three tablespoons of milk. I just pour it three times. Yes, just three times. Um, so one, two, three. Nice. Okay, now, after that, let's get our vanilla extract. Do you have your vanilla extract with you? I got mine right here. Nice. And you're going to get the half teaspoon. So half, so one out of two, TSP. One out of two, TSP. Sorry, it's kind of hard to see. Hopefully. I think I just put mine in the dishwasher. I'll have to go and find it. You have to go and find it? That's okay. Yeah, there's some that we have to reuse a bit, but it should be fine. Oh, don't worry, Gordon. It's okay. I totally understand if you can't join today. Um, for next week, we can talk about the hockey game that I went to, if you want. So I was so excited to go because I wanted to tell you about it. But it was so fun. I had such a fun time. What happened was that, um, like, they they – they lost, but they were winning at first. Is that, is that one the right one? Half TSP. Yes, that one. Then we're going to put just one scoop of vanilla extract. And go right at the top. Yes. Nice. And I'm going to pour mine in.
And then last step is I'm just cleaning up myself as I go. Our teaspoon. Teaspoon. So one TSP. One TSP. It should have a P on it, not a B. Hopefully you can see that. This right one. There. Yes. Wait, P, right? That's a P. Okay. And then you're going to put sprinkles on it. Sprinkles. So one teaspoon of sprinkles. Like that? Yep. And then you can put it in your mixture. Oh, I dropped some. And you can add a bit more too if you want more. But I think uh, that would be enough for me. I have a question though. If I have the mixture though. Oh, the mixture? Oh. Wait, what mixture? Ooh, a cake mixture. Ooh, that's cool. We can save that for next time. For sure. Can I just add it in there, though? Um, Because we already have all the ingredients that are needed for the mug cake already. So we wouldn't need that powder. But we can save it for another live, for sure. All right. So after that, we can get our spoon. And then since I did mine separately. I'm just going to pour my wet mixture into my mug. So that includes the melted butter, the milk, and the sprinkles. I'm just cleaning up as I go, so don't mind me. I'm just cleaning up as I go. That's okay. And then once you're done cleaning up stuff, you can get your spoon and you can start mixing the dry and wet ingredients together. You mix it nice and well in your mug. Uh, Gordon says, did you want, went to the hockey game last night, or are you happy that the Toronto is won the cup? <gasps> they did? I didn't go last night. I went last Friday. I went last Friday to see the game, and they lost when I saw them. Like, they were tied at first, and then they lost, which was a little disappointing, but that's okay. I had, I had such a fun time, because it was my first time going. Please, I mix everything in, then what? Nice, mix, mix it nice and well. I'm gonna mix it really nice and well. Make sure it's not clumpy with flour. Make sure that you scrape the bottom as well because all the flour is there. And like that, this is what the mixture looks like. Can you see? Yeah, this is how mine looks like. How does yours look like in the mug? I just, I'm just gonna like make... that. Ooh, okay, let's just mix it a bit more, just so it's nice and smooth. And it even comes with, I think, it comes with frosting, I do believe. Ooh, you can put that after we finish microwaving it. That's a good idea. I don't have frosting, but that's a good idea. All right. Again, I'm just going to scrape the edges, scrape the bottom so that everything is nicely mixed. And I'm going to tap my spoon. I'm, or I'm going to get my knife and scrape the excess once I finish mixing. How's it going, right? Seth? Yep, it looks good. Is it all um, mixed well together in your mug? In your mug? Yeah. That's good. Okay. So now you can, now, sorry, let me just mix mine just a little bit more. Nice. Just let me see yours. Away. This is my, how mine is looking. How does yours look? This is how mine looks. This looks somewhat okay. Lovely. Okay. 
Now we're going to put it in the microwave for one minute and 30 seconds. Yes. I'm trying to get all off my spoon. You can get another spoon to scrape it off as well. You can use an, get another spoon and then scrape off all the, the rest. Since it's kind of hard to tap it off. So I'm going to microwave for one minute? One minute and 30 seconds. Nice. Are you excited? Go. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's like a little. Or you can treat. usually buy it from the store though, too. You can get it in this thing. Yeah, you're right. But it's fun to also bake it with all the different ingredients, right? Ooh, I got it in this box though. Oh, that's cool. You can also make that after and see taste test which one tastes better. I'm just going to get you a little that. birthday surprise for me. Yeah. I'm just putting everything away right now. And then we can do it. Yeah, I just still buy my Christmas gifts. So I haven't I haven't done anything yet. I'm... Oh, your Christmas gifts? I like I need to start today though. I'm so bad. That's okay. I mean, yeah, getting started earlier is, is the, is the like, best. I don't get all the Black Friday deals, and my mom's like, why don't you start looking at all the Black Friday deals? And I was like, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm oh, so Gordon bad. asked like, how. Look at like a thousand how... stores. I'm like, what do you like? What do you want the most? Like, what do you what do you need? Like, what do you mm -hmm. like to have or whatever? Gordon asked you, how was your birthday? And are you ready for Christmas? Well, my mom's already started decorating house for Christmas, so. Oh really? That's awesome. Yeah, she just started. She just started. Um, she finished two things yesterday. Okay, now. I think I'll admit that it looks like really hot, so you can just be careful. That's okay. Do you have your toothpick? Why don't you get a toothpick too, so we can see if it's cooked all the way. I'm just gonna get my opening gloves because it's so hot right now. So I can't really... Yeah, no problem. Yeah, just be careful. We need help from mom and dad because this stuff is hot. So it is hot. Why don't you get a toothpick too, so we can see if it's fully cooked all the way. So a way to test it is by poking it through. I can get a fork though. And then if it comes off clean, with no like wetness, I guess, then it should be fine. If it's just crumbs, I think it's okay. It's good. How is it? Is it, it still wet? I poked it, but it seems to be... Is it dry or is it wet? I don't know, it's harder to tell when it's way down there. If it's pretty dry, cakey. It looks cakey? Okay, that's good. Do you want to take a picture together first before we eat it? I just want to double check though. I just make sure it's right. No problem. Does that does that look right though? It's like that. Yep. As long as it's not wet, then it should be fine. Is it wet for you or is it dry? It's dry. That's good. Did you want to take a picture together with our cakes together first? Let me and then just clean up my pot though before I do anything. Okay, we can clean up too. That's a good idea. I just had to clean up before before my parents come back. So I had to clean up a little bit. Yeah, that's a good idea to clean up. And then we can then we can take our picture and taste test it. I can also show you my pasta salad I've made. Oh, pasta salad? I made the pasta salad today, though, too. Is that your favorite thing to make? See? That's my pasta salad right there. Ooh, lovely. What's in your pasta salad? Um, pasta, pickles, cheese, mayonnaise. Ooh, that sounds so good. 
They made that earlier, so I want to have that for dinner, but there's not much left now, so. <laughs> All right. Should we take a picture together with our mug cake? Oh, make sure your your face is in the picture, too. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Yay! I think you really can't see the inside, though, because it's like it's way in there. Oh, Shanika said, show us the mug cakes. This is my mug cake. Yeah, there's some stuff in too, but it's my, cake. Mine's in my blue mug, because so you can't really see. If you tilt it like this a little bit, I think she'll be able to see. Oh, yeah, it's a little difficult to see, but it looks nice. You can also put frosting on it, too, but I don't have any. But I think Steph does. Yeah. It's an easy recipe to make. You can also buy it in this thing. You can also go to the superstore and buy buy the the mug cake though. Yes. That's an easier way. All right, should we taste test it? Ah. What do you think? Mm, it wasn't as easy as I thought it would be, but <laughs> it's okay. It's a, it's a good snack cakey, to but have. It's, it's a good snack to have. That's like, yeah, if you have these things laying around. It's just good on a cold day when you need a nice hot snack. Mm-hmm. I'm just like, eh, what the heck. <laughs> need a little bit of a reason to celebrate. It's like, this is all good. <laughs> it's very chewy and soft, which I like. But yeah, we didn't use eggs in it, which is really cool. I liked how the ingredients were pretty easy. Hmm. Be, just be careful, because sometimes the mug is still hot. So Yeah, the mug is still hot. So yeah, make sure you blow on it before you eat your cake. <laughs> so I made that mistake with the um, what was it? I burnt my tongue with with the. I burnt my tongue the one time that I had, that I had the um, squash soup the one time and I burnt in the back of my tongue. I was like, oh no, <laughs> when did it happen? Because like, I think we had. Squash you a few nights ago, but I, I remember burning the back of my tongue because I wasn't being careful, and I was like, like oh, that's fine, he's pulled off now. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we always have to blow our food before we eat. I didn't probably have that my, my godfather would make, or my godmother and my grandmother used to make soup, and then he put the ice cube in the middle of your soup. It's like, here, this will cool this off. And I was like, hey. <laughs> <laughs> was like, I'm like, when you went to go and eat it, it was like, it was like, the middle was so cold. It's like, I think I want to stop the microwave. Mm hmm The ice cube would make the soup so kind of, like, cold off or whatever, but it's still, like, is it one little bit of heat? You're like, I'm going to go warm this up again. <laughs> would you say it's a good hack to use uh, to use ice cubes in, in soup to cool it down? Or not really? Um, yeah, you can, but it, it'll make it a little bit more watery, but yeah. You're right. <laughs> Like it's, just you, like, it's it, incredible how me and my boyfriend can get along so well. It's like, like he's mm -hmm. good at like reading me, and we're like we're good at like synchronizing with each other. It's like, so like, what do you think of the weather? Whatever. It's like, what are you going on about? I was like, like no, I'm just being random. Like, like it's like, oh, we were talking about housing last night. Oh my god, we we're talking about like where we want to live in our future. It's like, so where do you want to live? He's like, well, I want to move to the country. I was like, but like. I want to live somewhere in the middle. Like, I don't want to just, like, leave all my friends. Like, I'm not, like, I'm not willing to compromise that. Mm hmm I'm like, I'm like, I'd rather live closer to the city because I have so many people that live nearby. And I was like, but I want to live somewhere nearby everyone else that I know. Do you have a place in mind where you want to live? Or is it more just so something I'm still that you're away from my of? nephew. Like, I want, to, I want to be able to stay with my, I want to be able to, stay close to where my nephew is so I can go and babysit him. Oh yeah, your newborn nephew, right? The one that just that he's one born? month he's one month old now, so Oh, what's his name? His name is Henry. Oh Henry, that's so sweet. It's like, That's cute. It's like, I think 
I think she took it after um, Henry uh, reminded reminded the character from from Queen of Minds is JJ, so his name Henry. It's like, oh my god, Henry! <laughs> and you're like, you're with the kid who holds on. So I'm like, yes, please. <laughs> Henry, was it a name? I can get you in. I can get you to in the Best Buy's broth with one phone call. <laughs> Like I'll get in door, no problems. I can get you on a one four call. Like, was it the name Brock? that they you want to go to mommy safety school? That was mommy safety school. You want to go there with mommy? You want to go there? You want to go to Brock with with Andy Steph? That was Andy Steph safety school. <laughs> like you want to go? You want them to go to the same schools that way that they feel safe. Like you want to go to Andy mm-hmm. Steph safety schools? You want to go there mm-hmm. with Andy Steph? <laughs> And he said, we'll get you there with one phone call. <laughs> and he said, I've known people, honey. That's and he said, I've known what to do now. <laughs> like, once you, like, I was watching my cousin's kids on Saturday night, because we went over for a great cup party, and I couldn't imagine, mm-hmm. like, she has, my cousin has two, two of her sons, I was like, I was, like, watching them, I was like, oh my god, I'm going to miss the days when they can't roll over. Like, mm-hmm. I miss those days when they can't roll over, where they can't like stand up. It's I'm like I'm gonna miss these days when they come running by. It's like I miss them when they couldn't stand up when they were like wobbly like a deer, where they had to like get someone like to like you don't pick them up by their shoulder blades, but you just like try mm-hmm. to pick them up by like their their waist or something. And so, like and you like assist them with their hands. I'm like here, let's go, like, let's go. Like they're like That's wobbly cute. over here. Like, like careful, like, like watch out of the way, like. Watch for the drawers and everything. You're like, you're like, and you're like, I can put like, I can put those pots on the floor and like, I can, mm-hmm. I can let them like bang, bang their hands on the pots like a drum or whatever. It's like, I gonna let them. I can let Henry play the drums. I'm like, yeah, honey, we can play the drums on the floor. Mommy, we're <laughs> mommy home on the way to the grocery store. That's cute. Because like, you miss the days when they couldn't like stand up, like, because they're like a wobbly little deer and you're like watching them. So like, careful, like, you can't go over there, like. You can't go over there either. <laughs> you stay in this floor. You stay where nobody can see you. Like, you put, like, because you need to put a baby gate. Like, you need to, like, soon me and my friend will have to install a baby gate so they stay in that one room. Like, careful. Like, you can't go past the baby mm-hmm. gate. So it's like you have to, like, mm-hmm. put that whole, like, parameter around where they can't go and where they can't walk. It's like, careful. Mm-hmm. Like, watch your chairs. Like, watch your footing. That way that you don't, like, so you don't want them to fall. So you're just like, careful. Like, you know, like help them open and like, and, like let them watch the windows and like yeah you can watch from here honey like you can watch from the windows so, like so, like when, by the time that mommy gets back then I can put them like like I hope that I'll be able to put them down for a nap and like here I'll just like mm-hmm. rock I'll just like rock him while, while mommy's a star it's like oh rock him rock him <laughs> for very gently and then like, just like rock him so, like he's gonna rock you a little bit so you can go to sleep and have a nap and then Put him down for nap and I'm like, and then just have the baby monitor in my hands. I'm like, okay, I can read for a bit before I wake up. So I'll just like get the baby monitor in my hands. Like, I'm just gonna read for a little bit before I wake up. But I have to go all the way upstairs. And I'm like, okay, just like get him up. Make sure mm-hmm. that he's okay. Make sure that he's mm-hmm. fed. And like, yeah, see, just ball downstairs or or she's gonna leave me a bottle or something. So I can, so I can have the, the milk bottle already for the baby. So I'm like, it's okay. It's okay. Mom just gone to the store. She'll be right back to you. <laughs> back in less than ten seconds. Anyway, it's a little baby. It's like it's harder because I remember like just watching like the young kids. Dude, I'm like, I really hope that I can make a big impact in their lives someday. Like, I really hope that I can be a role model. Mm-hmm. I'm sure you will. So like, you want them to become best buddies someday. It's like I think that they will become future best buddies and, and become future leaders because that's the way that I want them to know that that's there for them, that they have that access to that. Yeah. Like, Anyways, what? I'm glad that everything's going well with your, you and your oh, nephew. Oh, he's so cute. I'm going to have to send you guys photos, though. He's so cute. It's so like... Yes, for <sighs> sure. But I think our time is up for this week. I'm so... I, I'm, I hope you had fun while we were baking today. Did you? Oh, this is so much fun. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try the other one though too. Yes, please tell me how that one goes too. Anyways, <laughs> yes, one last fight for the the live. I'm gonna go and watch more manifesto. That's awesome. Yes, please tell me how it goes.
Anyways, <laughs> it's, just like, it's, it's weird. Anyways, bye, Steph. Bye. See you. Have a good day. See you next week. You too. Hey, bye, bye everyone.